<laughs> nine, twelve, fourteen. It's time. Hi. Hey, what's up, everybody? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Grubs. Welcome to Grubs. Uh, it's we are been, the Grubs. I'm, yes. I'm Jove. I'm Dell. I'm Tor. And we're g- greeted by our guest, Tor. <laughs> <laughs> Who just announced herself. Who <laughs> just announced herself. We've only recorded, this is our second time recording this. Probably the first one you guys will actually hear, and I still can't pronounce the show without giggling like a goofus grub. What's the official name? Grubs. Oh, just Grubs. Grubs. Yeah. Grubs. yeah, he came up with it. It's simple. We are grubbing. I'm not saying, no, it's good. It took me a while until I was like, hey, well, hang on, that's stupid. But then I thought, no. no, it's good. We have a history with that name. We have a whole yeah. group chat where it's, it's always been some iteration of grub. We certainly do have quite the history among grubbing. What was the original one? It was like, um, grubby, the, uh, the Grubby Crew or something like that? Yeah. Or, um, what was it? The Grubby, because it was based off that SpongeBob thing, the Grubby Grooster or whatever, Grubby Grouper. <laughs> like that guy, right? Or was yeah. it from a different source? No, I think. Yeah, I think. Yeah, I think you're right. I think it was like the Grubby Boys or something. I forget. The Grubby Boys. I think that was it. Yes, that was us. The that Grubby was the Boys. original. Yep. Boys, yeah. Everyone, write that down at home. You'll That's have a Grub test. Rebirth. We got Grub Light. And got, now we're just straight up grubbing it. I've got fear and loathing in Kentucky. <laughs> 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 That's, that's good. I like that. Well, speaking of our history, why don't we roll right off the bat with our first question? What I do basically is I ask people in our Discord for questions and shit, and half the time they actually respond. So today's is our first one is when and how did you all first meet? Which oh, I think shit. is um, maybe you guys should go first since you two go back further than I. Yeah, was it? Was it? Social We've st- talked about this actually. Yeah, social studies, right? I don't actually remember when I first met you, but I remember seeing you in the wild for the first time. I don't remember when we met. Mine's I, just me in the me in the distance. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. I was in the hall, like between classes, and there was you and some other kid who I can't remember. And this kid was like, "Yo, Jovi, for a hundred dollars, I bet you can't touch the ceiling." And you're like, "Bet!" And you were trying to jump and touch the ceiling, but you know we too. were in middle school, so you couldn't touch the ceiling. I did it. Did you? Yeah. Hell yeah! I didn't see that part. Yeah, I jumped uh, twenty feet in the air. Damn. And, um, <laughs> I actually walked on my hands, like <laughs> on the on the roof of the building. So that was pretty. Cool. Oh, I recall that now. Right, right. Freaked everyone out. I wasn't there, was so lockdown. I'm inclined to believe this. And I, well, you do that pretty much now too. So yeah, yeah, standard. That's pretty cool. Standard Joseman now. <laughs> but yeah, I think it was because we had that one class together, and then um, I think we just had like mutual friends that we kind of met through, right? I think so. We sat at the same lunch table for a while. Yeah. And that was cool. And you just integrated yourself. And I was like, hey, life. what's up? We're going to be friends for 15 years. <laughs> and I was like, oh, no. Oh, no. <laughs> At the end of that 15 years, though, you got to renew the contract. Right. It's a, <laughs> every deal. year, it's one corn dog. It's like regular <laughs> show. You have to light the bonfire and go fight the baby or whatever. Right. That's what you do have to do. You just get the power. The time in. baby. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So we just <laughs> yeah. dissipate into dust. <laughs> oh. oh. That's good shit. Because, yeah, I didn't encounter the lot of you until high school. Because yeah. you and I, sophomore, double block algebra? Yeah, double block, double block algebra. Oh, my yeah. God. Yeah, we were... I back was to back stupid. math. <laughs> yeah, we, I was in literally all the dumb classes. So, like, everything that's, like, you know, is stupid. You know what? The failures. I say that. I'm pretty sure I was also in <laughs> double block algebra. It's coming really? back to me now. I wasn't good at math. I think I remember you there. <laughs> no. you were, I know you weren't in any of our classes, but wow, oh, that's funny. <laughs> math is hard, okay? Math is fucking hard. I mean, you have to one plus one. I mean, <laughs> who the fuck? Where does that go? I don't know. <laughs> These are, you know, one minus. Then you get your negatives, which. Yeah, negatives got me. Yeah, who the f- what I never understood is that when it comes to, like, negatives, because, like, oh, you know, you're going to need to do math in real life, but it's, like, other than, like, tipping and taxes and whatever, when it comes to, like, m- like minus and, like, negatives, when the fuck are you ever going to need something that's, like, negative one? I have negative one apples. Like, no, you don't. Because yeah. zero is, like, nothing. Debt. Debt. Okay, so there's debt. That's one. <laughs> what else? That's all you need. That's all you got. Okay, well, yeah, so other than debt, I don't know. Just to have so many things about negatives just for debt. Yeah, they were all preparing us for debt. Yeah. Damn. Yeah. Oh, well, there you and go. Tipping and taxes, I don't do either of those things. So. <laughs> <laughs> it's not important to me. That's true. That's quite impressive. 
so I met Jove in math double block in sophomore year, and then I believe, was it senior year that we, no, Spanish, Spanish class, that was junior year, right? Yes. Yeah, junior, and I remember, I didn't sit with uh, Tor, so I didn't really know her that well, but I remember she walked into the room with like a Gorillaz t-shirt on, and I didn't really know what that band was, and I really liked the art of the band, so I was like, oh wow, that's pretty cool. Uh, I bet she's cool, but I'll never speak to her. <laughs> you never did. <laughs> and, I <laughs> and I remember that Spanish class too, because we all had to make video presentations for as a project for, I don't know, just something for like a final for yeah, the class. Something. And of course, I recorded mine in my basement last second because I didn't prepare for anything for that class. But one kid had a video, like, it was set up like a whole short film, had his rat in the video with him, a glowing skull. And I was like, wow, this is really funny. I better get along with that guy. This guy's a fucking idiot. This, this guy's guy, stupid. This guy's a loser. I'm gonna beat the shit out of this kid. Yeah. <laughs> Let's bully I'll see him. you after class. It is after class. <laughs> Yeah, it's funny because everyone in that class did bully me, and even the teacher, no. <laughs> no, the teacher was so nice. He was really nice. Except you. <laughs> but yeah, so that was that, and then she and I didn't really click until college, because we went to the same college. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the rest is shit stewie. Shit stewie. I guess and then I say. remember that fucking... The final project, I was with you, and I was with Ryan, <laughs> and I did the whole fucking thing. <laughs> Oh, really? No, you yes, didn't do I did. All of it. Yes, I did. I did. Some you did of nothing. It. I remember. Wait, so what part did you do? What part did you do? I did. Well, I did fucking everything, <laughs> and then he was there. Can you be specific? <laughs> okay, hang on. Okay, I will so admit. I, I remember. I, I remember <laughs> you have distinctly. I remember sitting in the. In the, <laughs> sip sip, the tea, sip huh? in the tea, <laughs> I remember distinctly. I was writing. Um, the essay, and you you were rolling on the floor giggling. <laughs> I remember that. That's not specific Vividly. enough. I do that all the time. You were rolling. I was like, "What do you, what do you think of this?" Like, <laughs> I roll on the floor. I roll in the mud. I mean, you gotta be more Ryan specific. Didn't, Ryan didn't right do now, anything. I'm rolling in the dirt because we're grubs. <laughs> and then Ryan, on the actual like front page of, <laughs> of the of our thing that I had to submit to the to the teacher, he he wrote as our names. Name one, hailed. Name two, <laughs> as. Name three, A. And then name four, God. Oh my god. Which is a, a reference yeah. to, uh, there's the Donkey Kong Country show, which is really stupid and ugly and lame. And, and beautiful. And there's a song that's called Bluster the Benevolent. And he goes, hailed as a god. Like, great. And go that, that was an inside joke. But let me fucking tell you, I didn't, that was just for a practice packet or whatever. That no one was supposed to see that. Our friend Ryan put <laughs> on the actual slide his name, Jovi's name, my name, Dylan Bluster, my last name. Yeah. God damn it. Yeah, that was on the actual point, on the PowerPoint, right? Yeah. And it's like, you fucking asshole. Like, why? <laughs> Dylan Bluster Fisher. Who cares? Fisher. So it's like, son of a bitch. Yeah. But yeah, I was like, all right, well, I guess we're not. Not graduating, so that's fine. Oh, you want, to, you want to, the real fucking kicker about what we got? Yeah, we got the, we got the, this is the inside joke. Our, our final grade, after all our hard work, all my hard work, <laughs> was D minus. Well, what does that say about know your work? which teacher graded that, and she was kind of like, not the person to make jokes yeah. with. No, she, she was, was, she took everything seriously. She was that teacher that was like, in college, they're not gonna let this slide. And that's not true, you know? Yeah. Yeah. I know who you're talking about, like, that, who that teacher was. And that was the D minus. Yeah, she was like an AP fucking teacher yeah. who stumbled into our, like, presentation. It's like, uh, we're kind of like, you know, the future custodians, so you can just keep moving, like, down the bench. Like, we're trying to get the yeah. substitute teacher who, like, doesn't care. We're actually here for practice, like, once everything's done. <laughs> we're gonna, you know, sweep up and... Yeah. <laughs> we'll throw away this trash for our project. <laughs> I remember re we had to do something about reaching out to schools and whatever, and I reached out to the schools. They just didn't respond to me. <laughs> so instead, like, I run around in the Job market. done. <laughs> Time to play some games. <laughs> they did do this thing where, like, for our senior year in the cafeteria, they had the TV on, and they, like, would put who was going to what college. <laughs> 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 Still trying to say he was going to Monsters University. He got called in. The <laughs> I did. Yeah. That's so uncool. They shouldn't let you do that. That's that so funny. It was fucking dumb because everyone like. I no was one going... wants to say 
you know, the community school. Yeah, I went to community college, which still counts, I think, even though I don't do anything with it. But I didn't want to say that because I didn't want to get, like, you know, I don't know, made fun of, even though there's, there's nothing to be made fun of about it, but <laughs> high school people, you know, whatever. So I figured, okay, yeah, I'm going to make Monsters University my thing. That'd be funny as hell. And yeah, I get called into the office the next day, and they're like, now we know you think you're funny. <laughs> like, we called we... Monsters University. <laughs> <laughs> You were never You did in not get admitted. <laughs> well, I'm gonna work in the mailroom. <laughs> like, yeah, fucking. Ugh. You're not a real scarer. <laughs> You're not scary. Yeah, I'm not scary enough for Monsters Inc. But no, I was fucking pissed. So I was like, look, I mean, come on, would not be funny? And they're like, we can't do that. And I'm just like, oh, yeah, yeah. That's so lame. Yeah. I mean, Everyone in that area cares yeah. too much. Sorry, right. go ahead. Meanwhile, my friend put Yale. Just like, and he's not going to yell. And they, they, they didn't say anything. What Dang it! Fuck? I should have said something like that. Harvard. Harvard. Mm. <laughs> uh, I go to Brown. I go to Brown. Me with my 2.7 GPA. <laughs> I'm I have a 2.3, I think. <laughs> I, had way, should be. I had way less. Depression. I had way less, but yeah. So that's how we all met. Pretty much in high school. Um, We're pretty epic. Yep. Uh, pretty uh, epic. Sorry. Pretty epic. Now, we have another question, which is, uh, which is, eh. How long does it take you to normally make, well, for me, a video, for Tor, her art, and for Joe, her, her, her your, yeah. your music? Yeah. So how long does it normally take? Well, I think I speak for everyone when it's, I say it uh, really depends on how hard we go in on it. And, like, mm -hmm. how, like, because yeah. for me, I mean, a little, like, impression video that's, like, less than 10 seconds or less than a minute, typically how I do it is I think of the joke, oh, okay, that's funny. Maybe I practice the voice for like an hour and it's like, yeah, that's good enough. <laughs> Record it, send it out to uh, edit. Maybe it takes about whole total process altogether, maybe like a couple hours, but not really. Oh gosh. Legendary. Yeah. My longer YouTube style videos, those would take like weeks because you got to write everything, you got to watch or absorb whatever I like react to or whatever. Mm -hmm. Record it, edit. Edit takes the longest time, so about a, like a week or two for that. But that's why I say, what about you? Me? Um, <laughs> it kind of depends. Like sometimes, like I'll just kind of be like fucking around, like just like on, like uh, whatever, like um, like a project or something. Like I have an idea and I'll just kind of play around with it. And like sometimes it'll go somewhere, or sometimes it'll just be like nothing, and I'll be like, all right, I'll just. I just name it like the date that I was working on it, because sometimes like I'll just go back and be like, oh, what was I doing? March 40, 40th. And then, like, uh, I know what's happening on 14th. <laughs> yeah. The day crabs rise. The day crabs rise. <laughs> and then, um, <laughs> but if I'm actually finishing like a full song, like if I, it depends on how like flushed out the idea is, but like I think it takes like a week, two weeks, maybe. Oh, okay. Like that. How, how many hours do you estimate? Per day, I guess like um, maybe like one or one or two, just like kind of like. Cause I'll bounce around, like I'll like work on it and then I'll like step away from it and like get back to it. I got I've, a I've asked you this before, but I always, how do you just start a song? Like, how do you make like rhythm and like beats and shit out of just nothing? Like, I I can't comp, my mind can't comprehend. Yeah. How. Som sometimes I'll just be like listening to like a song and I'll be like, oh, that's a, that's cool. Like maybe I'll do like my own kind of take on that. Or like I'll just have like a weird like melody stuck in my head. I'm like, what 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 song is that? And it's like, oh, it's not a song. It's my song. <laughs> oh, nice. <laughs> my, really? Yeah, I figure like the hardest part's getting an initial beat, and then you just build off of it. Yeah, like um, I'm weird. Like I'll think about like it depends. Like sometimes it'll be drums, sometimes it'll be melody, but like one one or the other kind of comes first, and then like I'll just kind of work from there, and then like either it'll like flesh out like oh this is cool, or like it won't be anything, and I'll just like kind of because I save everything. I have like just like mountains of projects just on my computer and then like I'll put out like maybe five five songs a year which is bad but I'm trying to get better at it but yeah I guess it just kind of depends but like yeah I think like when I'm actually like finishing an idea like it'll take like a week or maybe two weeks depending on how long oh okay Cool. Well, what about you? How about you, tool, tools? Uh, I take a long, long time <laughs> to do anything. Uh, one of the drawings I have on my account right now, it just takes me ridiculously long. I think 27 hours was one of my drawings. Uh, wow. Like, I, my problem when I try to animate, too, which is why you never see anything from me regarding animation, is because I'll, like, 
make a 15 second thing and then I'll just watch it over and over and over again. It's like, wow! And then I never finish it. It's like moving and shit! It moved! <laughs> yeah, so I take a really long time to draw and then every single time without fail, um, I'll try to put it online and I'll look at it right as I'm about to share it and I'm like, something looks wrong with this and I can't figure out what it is and I'll f- spend a long time looking at it like, what is wrong with it? And then I post it and then I find out what's wrong with it. <laughs> Yeah, that's always fun. For some reason, the audio for my video sometimes gets fucked up. Like, I think, okay, this sounds fine in the software, and then I'll, like, export it, and then upload it, and then I play it, and it's, like, really fucking quiet or way too loud. It's not the worst. God damn it! Yeah. It's always, like, too quiet, and it's like, whatever. Thanks for subscribing! (laughs) 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 Exactly. So it's like, god damn it! Whatever. <laughs> I think I'm getting better at it, but occasionally I'll get a comment like, I can't hear it! I can't hear, I can't hear. <laughs> Read my lips of the PNG character that don't move. <laughs> it's like, ah, uh, just like an open mouth. Ah, <laughs> uh, 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 Oh, he's angry now, he's angry now! <laughs> <laughs> don't make the PNG YouTuber cross his hands! <laughs> Ooh! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I've seen that. That's fucking good. Yeah, by the time like I'm, at, I actually put the song out. Like I'm just kind of sick of it because I've just been listening to it like over and over. So it's just like I do that. <laughs> That's oh my a God. big. I think we all share that fucking problem because yeah, every time I'm like it's out. Yeah. Yeah. I, then mm-hmm. you're over it. Yeah. Yeah. I've I've listened to every line I've ever said more times than I care, and every time I hit the X button, I'm like, this is the worst fucking thing I've ever done. Isn't that the worst feeling ever? Because you spend a long time on it, and there's always a point where you're like, this is the greatest thing ever, and then you share it, and it's like, this is garbage. Yeah. <laughs> For me, it's when I first start out. It's like this thing's already gonna be fire. I can feel it. Yeah. When it's yeah. Done and it's exporting. You just sit there, watch the loading bar, and you're like, this is gonna fucking ruin me. <laughs> or like, ruin this is gonna me. like. This is gonna suck. <laughs> right. You just pray to the algorithm that, like, something catches on. I just hope that not everybody universally hates it. And if that's the case, then... Which, typically, I don't think I've made anything that everyone was like, this sucks. So that's good. That's yeah. my stamp of That's my standard. <laughs> I just make shit for myself at this point. It's just... Like, oh, yeah. Yeah. I like to share it just because, like, I think yeah. it's cool. Like, it know, is giving people's like feedback and stuff but if i'm not happy with it then it's just like you know what's the point totally yeah. for me it's like having a little like library of things I've exactly done. Yeah. it's mm-hmm. nice to have it all in one spot that is very and nice. if i ever wanted to like because uh back in the day if you wanted to go to art school you had to have a physical portfolio with you so people would be toting on these big bags that's i remember you meeting you in college you had one of those big ass fucking yeah. folders the size of a school bus and there was one time where i was in chicago and um there was like this college that was having one of those portfolio reviews and I had like nothing on me and I was so bummed about it so I tried to show them my Instagram but it had sketches on it and they were like yeah this isn't a whole lot so now I feel like I've got like a portfolio in my pocket oh, yeah. yeah hell fucking yeah that's awesome yeah I tried to do the same thing just have like a portfolio of, like yeah because it's, it's kind of fun to look back on like you know stuff and like see how bad you were like three years ago <laughs> how bad you were <laughs> I think you're looking for progress <laughs> <laughs> yeah that's a good point it's all perspective looking for regression I'm looking for regression <laughs> I need to go back to my roots of being <laughs> terrible I started off just like Mozart and then I was just <laughs> <laughs> it's, the, ha! it's that horse that starts off drawing yeah. really well and it's like <laughs> exactly <laughs> yeah. it looks like shit uh, let's see uh, okay, so this one is going straight to Jove. How many songs have you made, and what is your favorite and our favorite of your tunage? Jove, start us off. How many songs have I made? Yeah. Uh, if you can count. Yeah. 74. <laughs> it's probably an undershot. Like, it, I guess it depends on, like, um, like, well, there's a there's two different answers. There's how many songs have I made and how many songs have I actually fucking finished and released. <laughs> ah. So, yeah, if, so what do you consider, like, uh, making a song then? One that you making, completed or one that you started? I would say, like, just one that I completed. I don't know how many... Because I have a bunch of stuff on my SoundCloud that, like, I just privated just because, like, I don't know, it's, like, kind of cringy, but... Um, Cause, but I didn't want to delete it just because, like, just good to have. But um, I think as far as, like, stuff that I have out on streaming services and, like, just out in the public, I think I have, like, like seven songs, I think. But as far as, like, projects and stuff, like, spanning, like, I, I've actually looked through, like, back. It's, like, spanning, like, I forget, like, when I started work. I think I started working 
more seriously, like with reduction, like around like the pandemic time. So just like four years of shit, just like like hundreds of projects, and some of it's just like nothing. It'll just be like drums and then, like nothing else. And it's just kind of funny because like I'll just like kind of look back and like I'll sometimes like take like a earlier project and like kind of work it into like something new, or it'll just be like you know crap, and I'll just be sitting on my computer just doing nothing. So. I guess like, I guess how many songs have I finished? Like I guess like seven, maybe. maybe. All right. But um, yeah, I'm, I work on music like basically every day, and I'll just like have like a like project a day. Like I try to at least like I try to just keep busy with it. Mm -hmm. So now out of all, so I guess then out of all the ones that you finished and released, which is one I guess maybe favorites a strong word. So maybe like what's one if it's easier that means like a lot to you. Um, like a lot, a lot. I feel like. I feel like my answer is gonna be the same as all of ours. Like, I feel like most artists just kind of like their most recent thing. You know what I mean? Because like it's just like it's the freshest, the freshest. Yeah. It always feels like your next best. Right. It's just wow. like, um, but I don't know. It's kind of weird because it's hard for me to judge myself. Like and just like be like, you know, I love this song. It's like my own song. Like I don't know. It's just like. Oh really? I mean, it's not that I, like, hate my own stuff, but it's just, like, kind of weird, because it's, like, me. It's, like, yeah. it's not, like, it's, like, you know, like, you look in your reflection, and it's not, like, I, I need to kiss this person. I just, you know, I don't know. That was a weird, that was a weird analogy. <laughs> no, I get it. Just, like, kind of looking at, like, your own stuff, because it's just, like, you know, it's something I made. Cause it's, it's, a piece, like, it's like a piece of you. Yeah, and it's, like, I don't know, because, like, other people are going to see it differently than I do, so it's like I'm never going to get that perspective, you know what I mean? That's so, true, so yeah. kind of interesting, but yeah. what about you guys? Well, for me, I think... I we have might a have favorite. The, we might have the same answer, so I'll let you go first, because I think I'll let you do it, and then I'll just pick my second favorite. Okay, Trash Boat's my favorite. Oh, yeah, yeah. Trash Boat, yeah. Trash Boat's so good. That... I was asking like of like your own stuff, but like I appreciate like you're saying. Oh yeah. I'm pretty sure that's what they Trash meant. Boat was one of those songs, like when I like a song enough, I will listen to it on repeat for day to days. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So and that was one of the ones I listened to for a long time. Oh yeah, got a good amount of mileage out of that one. Yeah. <laughs> that was um Yeah, that was like a quicker song. Like that didn't take me as long. I think it was I was just kind of like listening to like a bunch of like house music and I was obviously watching like regular show. <laughs> Um, I think it's still out on streaming. I'm I hope sure. so. Yeah. I when I watched that Apple episode, I'm oh, sorry. That was an old one. That was like, it was like three years ago. Or something. Yeah, it's already been a few years. That's wild. Time flies. Yeah, and look at you now. Look at you now. Look at me nowhere. No. <laughs> I mean, you can't fucking say nowhere because guess what? Every, everyone at home, everyone. we're going to see Jove do his live DJ thing tonight, like later. So that'll be fun. Yeah. yeah. DJ Gross. thing. Yeah. <laughs> Is it DJ? You, you spin the table or something. You do the rook 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 Old school. Old school. <laughs> I guess I'll say my favorite of like your guys' stuff. Um, I think I think your most recent like um, drawing like the the one with the guy inside of the um, the yellow like fish creature. Oh. I think that's my favorite of yours. So far. Mm -hmm. Thanks. I like how that one turned out that too. That one was crisp. Yeah. I will say one of my favorites of yours has got to be like Welcome to the Era of Blue, where it's like your fucking chompers are right there and they look like you, you look like you, if you stand up to them you could like see your face in the reflection. It just looks so fucking crisp and I like the way you drew your hair. Yeah. Oh, thanks. I don't know. The big you do that big mouth with the fangs look really goddamn well. Oh. You know, so I, I really enjoy that one. I, all hail the Blue Era. The that's, blue era. that's a huge <laughs> compliment because I love drawing the spiky teeth. There's so much fun. Yeah. I love your OC. I think it's really cool. It, it like looks like sort of like Susie from Delta Rune, and also like well, that's how like she looks chain, in real life. Yeah, you like know a what? Chain chomp. You know what's funny is like uh, I don't normally get a whole lot of like people don't normally see my stuff. I put it online, and the algorithms like in the trash. In the trash. <laughs> but that one picture of Susie I put online, just people still like it. And I'm like, yeah. of course yes, it's Susie. Should. Of course it's Susie of all people. But it was a good one. Thanks. And I don't know. I mean, sharp well, teeth, though. well, that's sharp actually teeth. how she looks like. I mean, the people. Mm -hmm. I think watching us on YouTube see the little thing of all of us sitting at a table. That's live. We may not be moving our mouths, but no, this is how we all are. Yeah, it's huge. It's pretty cool. <laughs> she can throw me like a football field's length away. It's pretty great. It's pretty we get cool. a good spiral. Yeah, Dill IRL is four foot one. <laughs> <laughs> because of fucking you, people actually think that. Like people think I'm like five foot four. Yeah. It's like no, no. 
there's a fucking game comes quote that Tori introduced me to where it's like Aaron's like people send me like medium sized shirts or like smalls because they think I'm a petite little boy when I am actually a large fat man. <laughs> it's like yeah, I'm, I'm like I'm a big man. That was You're not huge. Not like big. But you I'm are like, bigger I'm than like people big. like yeah, would think. That's what I meant. Well, you used to be fat. I, yeah. I, I used to be fat too. I'm trying. I've actually been hitting <laughs> the gym. It's the fact that you said two. <laughs> <laughs> Belly bros. <laughs> <laughs> it's nothing to be ashamed about. But like no. food. Dude, I fucking love to eat. I won't lie to that. Cool. Uh, it's good. But, uh, let's see. Okay, what's the next question then? Oh wait, hey, what's your favorite of my thing? I need attention too. Um, uh, mm. no, nothing. I like your song <laughs> covers a lot. Oh really? It's hard to pick one because you make a lot of stuff, and I a did. lot of it's good. So, um, oh, thank you. Like, I think on your Instagram you've got up like four hundred posts or something. Even your YouTube channel is like over. A, I'm on a th- several hundred posts, so it's like yeah, it's than, hard to pick one. Yeah, other than like this project and a few other just like other things, I'm kind of taking a break, so I'm probably gonna go like weed through everything. Yeah. Like some of the older memes that just aren't that funny, I'll just go through and like get rid of them, shrink down. Yeah, mine's probably. Um, I mean, I love the wholesome horror, obviously, like, that's, like, I think, um, like, I'm super proud of you, like, just seeing that. Oh, thanks. Seeing that. (laughs) Because it's, like, surreal, because I'll see, like, um, like, friends of mine, like, other friends of mine, like, um, like, repost it, just, like, just, like, because they, like, just like it, like, they don't know you. (laughs) They don't know you, and it's, like, morons. I knew this guy, he was rolling around (laughs) when I was writing this. (laughs) (laughs) Hey, you fucking failed it, though, so. Yeah, I did. I'm just kidding. (laughs) I was like, I did it, and then we failed. And I was like, fuck. It's a fucking teacher, man. I'll tell you. No, I do have a favorite. I really liked when you made the live action um, Cryptic Corners. Those were awesome. Those were yeah, fun. Yeah, those were really fun. Those were so cool. You they have a there. special place in my heart because they just, I don't know, they had a vibe to them that I don't think I've seen yeah. anywhere else. They were goofy as fuck, and I enjoyed that. They were really goofy, but in the best way. They they had they have a good balance of serious and goofy. I just, like, don't know how to work a camera, so it's just, like, the angles of me, like, fucked up. Hey, you worked it pretty well. Dora was a great puppeteer for the one person watching who might remember this. Well, there's a video where the character Cryptid Chris interviews Kermit the Frog, and you were Kermit. Yeah. That was good, yeah. We all went to a park. That was a good day. That was a good day. We had to take, like... We could only film, like, one second at a time because, like, people kept on, like, <laughs> walking in and just feeling like, Oh, yeah. look at this! Oh, yeah. this is nice. I forgot about that part. We should have bought out the whole park just... <laughs> just yeah, with our oodles of money. With my five whole dollars and a grumbled, like, expired <laughs> coupon to Wendy's, I will buy the whole park. Mm, my YouTube AdSense should pay for this. <laughs> yeah, the five cents. Fi- <laughs> yeah, the five cents they give me. <laughs> and the four cents you're taxed on. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Right. Oh, big ticket. <laughs> <laughs> Eat it no no fucking kidding. Yeah, holy shit, dude. Oh, okay, here's a new one. What are your opinions on horror films that are, quote, based off true events? Uh, I don't know, dude. Got an example? Well, fucking... Sur- okay, well, this isn't a horror movie, but fucking Surf's Up, that penguin <laughs> surfing movie, in yeah, the trailer, it said based on a true story. That is a very scary movie. I mean, it is film. <laughs> <laughs> it's impressive they got all the penguins to talk, like, trained and all. It's a documentary, so right. yeah. <laughs> yeah. How do they get the camera all around is what I want to know. So, especially in the water. <laughs> <laughs> well, I remember, you know, I had a Z necklace too, so I remember Did you? Even, no. Did, aw, I was gonna say, that movie's actually good. I like Surf's I Up. I watched it a few months ago. You know, it actually is pretty good. I thought it was. But you, I don't know. You put it on and, like, just, you were wearing the Z necklace. You were just, like, you know, <laughs> you're bouncing it like a baby. You just, like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, I was, and, and I was naked, so and you're that's naked. the only thing I was wearing, yeah, was that. And just drooling on yourself. <laughs> well, I do that anyway. Drooling on the Z necklace. <laughs> 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 Well, I don't know. Horror movies based on What's um, the, true events. Was the Blair Witch Project supposed to be off of something real, or was that completely fictitious? No, it was just supposed it was, to look real. Yeah, it was That just, movie is so annoying to watch. Really? Have you but watched yeah, it recently? Not recently, but I just remember it's a lot of running around like, oh my god! That's like yeah. one of my favorite movies, honestly. Really? really I'll like have it. to give another watch then. I like it, but yeah, some, I mean, as someone who has motion sickness, some of those... Well, maybe that's not even true. I don't know, but it is a lot of shaky cam, yeah. but it's like, it's still... A, it fucking did it first, I think. I think it's just like the like the horror of just like like truly being like lost, like you have yeah. no idea like where you are, how to get out of like, no 
just the idea of that like just makes me feel like you know what I mean so it's just that like, is um, cre- yeah especially like the moments where they're like oh we've been here before like I've seen that rock I've seen that dog turd like <laughs> we've been here before you know that's what the one goofy scares part, me <laughs> the one goofy part the guy's like I just threw the map in the river <laughs> like, it's, like, <laughs> it's like why <laughs> we've all it's got like that I hate one. this map it's so stupid I just threw it in the river <laughs> and like the guys are like what What the fuck did you do? based on a true story <laughs> just right. I need to rewatch it though because it has been a while but I remember it being pretty still pretty very impressive and I fell on a horror a found footage which I think is the official subgenre. Yeah. I've been on a bit of a kick, and there's actually been a few gems. I'm gonna look up the title. Again, this is not based off real events. Because I don't know, like like another thing too is like, is it like is this like, you know, like I try not to be like too much of a skeptic and just be like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, um But I guess it doesn't really matter to me. Like it just matters if it's like a good movie, I guess. As long as it's not like gratuitous, like we're gonna reenact like a real murder and yeah. really over the top and yeah. it's like well, let's not do that so I guess it just depends on how it's made cause I mean and I Jeffrey guess Jeffrey Dahmer on Netflix or whatever. yeah Dahmer yeah I didn't watch that show but my sister did I did uh, not people were obsessed with that show it's yeah. like he's so cute that yeah. is disturbing it's just like it's like okay hopefully you just literally mean the actor Evan Peters I believe is his name but they got him they got the, the man himself <laughs> is, Dahmer, is Dahmer alive? Nah, he's dead. Mm. That dude's at the, dead. Literally at the end of the, what happened, he got murdered in prison. Oh, like yeah. another inmate like beat the shit out of him. That's yeah. justice in my book. Yeah, I was gonna say, I kind of deserved that one. Yeah, I watched that clip online because I got a thing for that. It's gonna happen to Dan Schneider here in a second. Hopefully. Oh, God. <laughs> Apparently he's suing the people who made yeah, that Yeah, he, admit, he admitted he to is? everything, yeah. yeah. He admitted to everything and then he's like, actually, I'm gonna sue all of you. Reverse, reverse. <laughs> Yeah, good luck with that, Dan the Man. Dan the Man. Dan the Footman. Did you say there's footage online of, like, Dahmer getting beat up? No, not footage. It's the reenactment for the show. Oh, reenactment. So it's fake. Yeah. Mm. You're like kicking butts, dude. <laughs> <laughs> I love the young people. How many times are you going to teach you this lesson, old man? <laughs> but. <laughs> That's good fucking shit. Okay. Ooh, another movie one. Uh. If you were to direct your own horror movie and cast whoever you want, what would be the movie plot? I got so many of those, that's not fair. Well, we kind of uh, did that, didn't we? Pre- Hunt 2, Electric Movie. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah me and good. my friend have our own movie that we tried to make when we were kids. <laughs> that's bad. We actually Don't tried to make a bad. movie about you, Jove. Remember Average Jove? Oh, we, yeah. we had a whole <laughs> script, and we like knew what we were going to do. No, you know what's crazy, though? <laughs> um... I didn't know this until, like, after I graduated high school for, like, a little while, but, like, people would film me walking around. That is true. What? I remember people yeah. did that. People Wait, would film what? Me. what? Yeah. Why? Yes. Here, I'll tell you about it. It's called... They made an Instagram account. Like, I'm not going to say the name. But, like, it was basically just... Like, it was literally just me walking through the halls. And it's just, like... It was... And it, the crazy thing is that, like, I would have, like, a weird... Like, you know, like, one of those, like, um... What's it called? when it's not, like, founded on, a, like, um, like, an unrealistic fear, or what, what is it? Oh, like a phobia? No, like, um, like, when it's, god, I can't think of the name, but anyway, I had, like, a, like, a fear of, like, you know, like, people, like, irrational fear? Irrational fear, yeah, irrational fear of, like, um, people doing that, and it was actually happening, so it was just, like, kind of wild. That doesn't sound irrational now. <laughs> yeah. Exposure How did you find there? out? Did, like, a friend show yeah, you? Yeah, my friend's like, hey, I, I, I feel like I should tell you at this point, like, we've been, we've been filming. Wait, also, it was your the friends. person that was in on it told you? Yeah, like, one of them. And it was a friend? How many? Yeah, it was, like, a friend of mine. Like, um, it was, like, two people I was kind of, like, acquaintanced with, and then, like, two, like, of my closer, like, friends, like, they knew about it, and they didn't, like, tell me about it. So it was what just, like, hell? I guess they thought, like, I walked funny or something, like, I just, like, because, I mean, I was kind of chubby, so I guess, like, I, I, I like, waddled around. Or something, and like I guess what like what year they, was this? Like, do you remember? Or like it was what like grade of high school, like 20, 2014, 2013. Like people were just like wa- like filming me like walking around. What the and fuck? And that could have been like that could have been like an early found footage, you know, thing, that series. A cryptid like, I, my favorite cryptid, Joe. My favorite, yeah, just me. I guess I am a cryptid. Because that's how you found me. You just saw me like walking around. Yeah. You literally did say you just saw him from afar coming. And I didn't get it. Like I guess like I don't get it either. What the hell? People recognized you like a lot too. Like in photography class that I took. I don't remember why. I think I used you for a project. That's what it was. And the whole class was like Jovi, and I was like, (laughs) 
How is he so famous? I'm just, like, I, so stupid in public. I, I remember going to a football game with you, and you kept fucking getting stopped, like, every three feet. It was insane. Like, so many people kept, like, calling out to you, and it was like, oh, am I with a celebrity right now? Oh, my gosh. Like, that was crazy. I remember that shit. Because I don't, I don't remember being, I mean, I remember a lot of people knowing me, but I wasn't, like, like a popular kid. Like, I kind of just, like, was, like, in, like, the nerdy crowd, just kind of do, doing that shit. But, um... Yeah, just, I guess well, yeah. it was cool. I mean, I was bullied a lot, so I think, I think that kind of tied into it, but... Um, but yeah, like, uh... Yeah, it was just, like, videos of me walking around. Damn, so. I, didn't, I had no fucking clue when that, that happened. Holy yeah, shit, that's, that's what, weird what, what were we talking about? I forget. Uh, found footage. Oh yeah, that was found footage. I guess so, it Found yeah. by you, yeah. It's based on was true that stories. Was account so. taken down? Yeah, I, I, I was just like, yeah, can you... <laughs> not. Yeah, fucking reasonable. Yeah, that's really strange. Because I guess it's cyberbullying, but yeah. I mean, I I didn't care. I was more just weirded out that it was happening. Just yeah. Like, yeah. That would make me kind of paranoid. Thing. Yeah, and it was like weird because like um, they'd be like quick, like one second one. Like it's not even like <laughs> like it's just like me walking. Oh, literally, like, just like boom. Yeah. That's it. Like, it would be like, um, just had a conversation with the man. Like, I, I just, like, like, I'd talk to somebody, and, like, as I was walking away, they were just like, like, okay. Kids are fucking weird, dude. Yeah. They just High school was wild. Time. Yeah. It was like, a wild time. Ugh. God. Don't miss it. Yeah, I can't say I miss it. I see a lot of people say, like, oh, I want to be a kid again, or a teenage yet. Fuck that. I love being a young, an adult. I miss everybody being, like, close. Like, yeah. I miss, like, um, okay. like, having all my friends, like, you know, that just drive over to their place or something. Yeah. I mean, I guess I do that with you, but... Yeah, I was about to say, <laughs> that hasn't really changed for me. But just, like, having, like, you know, I don't know, a circle yeah. of things and, like, things happening, I guess. It was cool. Mm -hmm. Good times. And bad times. I have a lot of freedom now, so I wouldn't trade That's that true. for anything. That's true. Yeah, how does that fucking feel? It's a double-edged sword. Responsible for everything now, but at the same time, I can do whatever I want. I'm gonna, I mean... I do think we're living in a pretty good time, like, yes. all things considered, because shit's pretty easy to manage. You pay your rent on, like, an app and whatever, like, mm -hmm. I have automatic payments for a lot of my shit, it'll notice, so it's actually not as hard as a lot of some of you youngsters might be afraid of. It's, I mean, as long as you got a good head on your shoulders, you can manage it. The thing that is hard is, like, nothing pays well enough. You have to work yeah. really hard to be able to afford anything decent. Yeah, let me tell you guys, man, like... Despite everything that we've done, like, yeah, we're nowhere near make, back on making a living through yeah. this shit. <laughs> all, all, you, all you aspiring independent artists, it's not too late. <laughs> you can, you can, Honestly, yeah. start today. <laughs> It'll yeah. take a long time. It's Either. not too late. You can quit. <laughs> Please. <laughs> It's not too late to quit? Yeah, it's not too late. Just fuck it, just get out it's now. It's not too late to give up on your dreams, everyone. Right. <laughs> There's, it's always a good okay. day to stop. <laughs> it's a beautiful day to give up. Unless you want to be, you know, broke for a while. <laughs> Okay, here- oh, this was obviously just a fucking joke. Who would win in a fight, Joe or Dill? You. I have horrible stamina. You so, have a good, um... I pr you I have bulk, too. I probably have more bulk, so if, like, if I get you on the ground, I'll just, like, sit on you. But, like, I'm not gonna, like, hurt just, you. Like, flop on me. I feel well, like just we'll just end you. up kissing again. <laughs> <laughs> Try to steal a kiss? It just- it'll just become too homoerotic at a point. So you're welcome that we don't do that. Yeah. So you're- <laughs> Well, yeah, there's your fucking answer. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> For two seconds, we don't even dive. It's like that. Thanks scene for the fucking question. In Congress, <laughs> it's like Kong x Godzilla. It's, it's a real a clash of titans. <laughs> oh my god. Oh shit. Okay. Uh, all right. Here's another one. Um, any funny work stories from the past? Cause I don't think, uh, or from the press, just any funny work stories. What, what you got? What you got? All right, I've got one. This feels like airing bad laundry though. Go so off. there was a time um, where I worked at my very first job, where we had like a break room where you could eat uh, your dinner, and they had a microwave, like plastic forks, knives, and spoons. This, sorry, this was the drugstore, right? Yep. Okay, cool. And on my break, I always wanted to be alone. I just didn't want to talk to anyone, see anyone, breathe the same air. Like, I, I wanted to be alone. Big I'll same. Sit, sit in my car and eat. And yeah. Yep. And there was a door that would let you into that break room that had a little, like, plastic window in it that you could see through. And I would always bring, like, ramen to eat, so I'd just pop it in the microwave and then eat my ramen. 
Yeah. Well, that day, uh, there was, a uh, there was, first of all, a new guy who had just started who was up at the front, and it was me and him working. I was in the back, about to eat my lunch. Just got my ramen out of the microwave, and noticed there weren't any forks. There were only knives, and I was really hungry. <laughs> so I was, like, you know, scoped out the area, looked around, and I just started eating it with my hands, and then oh. I look up... <laughs> And then there's the new guy coming in, so I like threw it to the thing. I was like, Ooh, like put my hands down, like. You like eating the ramen like, with your hands? Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Did it like burn? No. <laughs> Dude, one I noodle at a hungry. time, or did you just like pick up the whole thing and just a like sweaty handful? Yeah, sweaty handful. Like, a, like an apple, like you just like took the whole. Yeah. Yes. If there were knives, why didn't you just use them as chopsticks? As chopsticks? I mean, kind of. What's sort of. Talking? That could have. I guess that could have worked. So I there's didn't no think forks or anything. No. Or spoons. Nope. <laughs> you hesitated on that one. <laughs> I mean, this was how many years ago? Oh, yeah. But I don't. Yesterday. If there Do was you not a, have the photographic <laughs> picture? <laughs> if there was a spoon, I would have used it. Spoon. <laughs> I was desperate, Job. I was desperate. You could have drank it. Drank it? Yeah. I, well, what are you gonna? I mean, you're eating it with your hands. I mean, you might as well just like you know. <laughs> you just, just cup it. it. Like, <laughs> yeah. Next time it happens, I'll remember that. Right. Just drink, the, drink the broth and then like um, just eat the. Just like slide the noodles. Oh, that's what that you guy. mean. Yeah. It was like instant ramen. It wasn't like a bowl of ramen. Oh, okay. So like a brick of it. Oh, not a brick, because like, I mean, I guess it came in the package as a brick, but when you put it in the microwave, it softens up, and it's just like the equivalent of like eating spaghetti. Oh, okay. I okay. thought you meant like a cup of ramen. I gotcha. Yeah, not a cup. Yeah, eating that with my hands would have been impossible. So you, so you did it with no water or anything? I don't, uh, I mean, you heat it up with water, but it absorbs the water. So you so just you have just the ate noodles. Like noodles. Okay, yeah, gotcha. yeah. I was I told, eating handfuls of noodles. No, no, not that. Well, that I can I can see how that paints so you a had different like the picture. Pack, like the package. Yeah. And then you put it in. You, so you put it in a bowl. It comes in its own like tray. Oh, okay, and then you just put a little water in. Okay. Yep, and then it absorbs the water, okay, and then it's you. noodles. There you go. Yep. <laughs> Did he catch you? I don't know. <laughs> you watching the whole time. Yeah, <laughs> honestly, who cares? Mark your territory, throw noodles at the wall. Is <laughs> 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 that the only thing I'm throwing at that guy? <laughs> That's a good one. Let's see. What's a fucking funny one on my end? Um, bah, 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 bah. I worked at a zoo. It was my first ever job. So I guess we'll start with first jobs. Oh, yeah. Uh, my first job was working at a zoo, and I worked at, like, you know, some disgusting pizza, like, hot thing so it was like hot sweaty and I hated it and I had no friends and I was a loser and they all hated it oh my me. god and um so yeah no legit I was just honestly quiet and obviously I didn't want to be there but I still did the work but just you know I was a teenager yeah and um they would just set since I wouldn't like really jive with everybody not like I didn't get along but just you know I wouldn't talk very much and so oh Joe's cat just joined the chat uh, <laughs> another guest. <laughs> another guest, yes. Hello, big bus. Uh, fuck. How does it feel to be a big bus? How does it feel, bus? I want to give him the mic. Come I here, think buddy. It'll reach him. He's a, silent, on up. he's a silent man. Oh, get him to purr. No! no! Alright, he, uh, he bound away. Uh, okay, what the hell is I talking Right, they would always send me away to, like, go to different huts. Like, they, uh... It was like a water park, too. So it was like, hey, you got to go over to the Pelican Hut or whatever today. And I'd be like, fucking adios. Because I really had, f I was friends with, like, other people there, but not in my own hut. <laughs> so they sent me to work with someone who I went to high school with. So I was like, oh, shit, like a friend. So I hang out with him, and I just, like, he was at some, like, ice cream stand where it's really, it's just a one-person stand. But I would go stand with him so there'd be just the two of us. And he fucking just one day gets out a jar for tips. And we are not supposed to have tip jars. Yeah, like, yeah. that's heavily enforced. But he was just, I was like, are you supposed to do that? And he's like, I don't care. <laughs> So yeah, what he split move. tips with me that day, but I, it was like a good two dollars. So yeah, that's your first money. million. Yeah, my first dill dollar. Your millionth dollar. <laughs> Big crumply, sweaty dollar. You put it on the wall. Yeah, I mean, fuck, I baked in the fucking hot sun, surrounded by like little kids pissing in the pool and elephant shit. So it's yeah. like I might as well earn a dollar there <laughs> extra. You go. What about you, Big Jove? Uh, my first job, I worked at a supermarket. 
and I was I was a cashier, and then like I was so shitty of a cashier, they like put me on. Um, they just made me one of those guys that gets like the carts. <laughs> I was one of the. That was my next job after the zoo. <laughs> yeah. And um, I'm trying to remember like um, they told me to clean the bathroom, and I was just like. I'm grossed out by it because it's just like there's like shit everywhere and like oh um, no effort to aim yeah and I'll just like <laughs> I'll, I'll clean it and like um they tell me like the mirrors are disgusting and I'll go, <laughs> I'll go in there there'll be like one like tiny spot oh. and then I'll get the spot and then like um like I'll go out for a second and then like uh somebody will meet back up with me like you didn't clean the mirrors I'm like I did I got the spot it's like, oh I just went in there and it, it's disgusting <laughs> I just went in there and sneezed all over I the sneezed, mirrors and yeah, now they're exactly. all ruined. <laughs> So this gross. is your fault. <laughs> and it was always the women's bathrooms that were grosser, because it's just like... That is women? true. That tracks. That happened when I worked at a Buffalo Wild Wings. They were nasty. <laughs> women like, are right. not any better than men. Don't let anyone fool you. They're May just I ask, worse. why are women so fucking disgusting? Um, <laughs> it's like, it's shit, and then there's blood, like, everywhere. Yeah. <laughs> good mixture. You get all, all over the walls. <laughs> <laughs> and then there's, like, the they fish odor. It's caked. <laughs> It's cakes. You know, it was in the women's restroom once where I did find, and my manager pulled me in to look at this. <laughs> She's like, you need to see this turd in the toilet. <laughs> I, I, made, I made that. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's kind of like her to do that, so it wouldn't have surprised check me. Check it out. <laughs> but it was a perfectly, like, the mic we're looking at, it was a perfectly spherical turd. Really? Wow. It looked like, like a softball. I need you to put that in your mouth or you're fired. <laughs> Throw it in the deep fryer. Yeah. <laughs> But, yeah, we all, like, we all, three of us came in to, like, look at it, like, how did this come out of a human being? So there's just three, like, people just standing around, like, wow, that is a spherical turd. Yeah. It, it couldn't flush, like, it was too big. Or yeah, it, it clogged the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta to... shove, like, a broom handle in there and break up the turd. Yeah. Uh, yeah. That's fucking impressive. Those bathrooms were, like, weirdly gross. Like, that happened, and there was a time where I would close pretty often, and I didn't check the bathroom one night, and I was like, yeah, but I totally checked it, and they were like... Oh, when I came in that next day, they were like, we found a used, like, adult diaper on the ground in the men's bathroom. <laughs> How did this happen? I was like, oh, that's mine. That's mine, my bad. <laughs> it's mine. <laughs> well, sounds like you made the right call not cleaning it, so you didn't have to deal with that. Or did you deal with it in the future? No, I didn't have to deal with it. Oh, well, then perfect. There you go. It worked yeah. out. Man, I used to work at a gas station, and one fucking morning, this... <laughs> a, a customer came in, and it was a senior citizen... And he just starts waddling off to the back where the bathroom is, stops, and then, like, I'm just like, all right, whatever, I'm just doing my thing in the front. He walks by me, looks me dead in the eye as he, like, moves by me and just goes, I'm so sorry, and leaves, and I'm just like, okay, huh. And, uh, the gas station was weird. It wasn't, like, just a gas station. It was, like, a little small independable place yeah. and it was shared with an actual garage like a repair shop a single mechanic had like one garage and he would just work on cars he was a nice guy he go he comes in and goes what the fuck and like um, he, he's like D fish because that's what they called me someone shit all over the floor and i'm like no way so i walk over and it's like it looks like a big spot of fucking like oil with yeah. like applesauce i just spit with that oh yeah Viewers at home, imagine that. So yeah, and he, we just we look up at each other, and I'm like, I do not get paid enough. Oh my god. <laughs> he ended up cleaning it up, thankfully. But yeah, it looked like a fucking oil slick, like right out of a video game, except with like mashed potato mash in there. Like it was right. fucked. I had like a similar story. Like I like that we all have like shit cleaning <laughs> stories. <laughs> like, um, I was working at um, CVS, and like I think like some some guy like brought there. Like kid in and like, like the kid was just like you know violently shitting as they do and just like <laughs> rocketing. I think out. like um as like as they were cleaning did. it like there was like a little bit of like spillage on the ground, and then oh. they made me like they made me clean it up. Like I remember distinctly like my like assistant manager's like I don't clean up shit and like they made like made me do it. Like I was like <laughs> okay I guess, and I did, but it was just like like I don't clean up shit. And I remember like one time like I think I clocked out like a little bit early and then like the next day like he's like I don't appreciate you clocking out early and making me work I'm like I'm sorry you have to do your fucking job dude like, like, <laughs> we all worked with some one of those yeah yeah you like, made me work you made me work yeah let it be known everybody at home though yeah you know we may be animators musicians and voice actors now but we've all spent time picking up turds and fucking being bossed around so mm -hmm. well we still are being bossed around, but... And I still pick up to it. 
<laughs> well, now it's for fun. <laughs> now it's your own kids. Yeah, now you can pick them up and play with them, you know? <laughs> <laughs> roll, roll them around roll in your hands. That's <laughs> <laughs> what Dri- you do between sets. Dribble back. Yeah. <laughs> God, now I'm remembering another time. Not relating to turds, though, but shifting gears. I used to work in an Italian restaurant, and... <sighs> <laughs> I was a bus boy, so I would just like bring people's food for like bigger parties and like you know clean up and tables and whatever. And so I'm bringing food to a big party, and I'm, it's just the appetizers. And so I find a good like spot between two people, a clearing, and I drop off their little fucking appetizer. I'm like, okay, coming through with the meatballs. And to my left is just another senior citizen. And this woman just like her head was just like she was sit back in her chair. Her head was like resting on like the back of her neck. Like her face was like she was looking directly up into the ceiling, but her eyes were like slammed shut and her mouth was like hanging open. She looked like she was dead. She was like she was just prepping for the meatballs. She wanted she wanted to I swear, she wasn't fucking breathing. I was just like, uh. It's like a, she it's thought like, it was like a hibachi grill yeah. where they throw them into her mouth. <laughs> it's like the um, like the arcade basketball thing. Like you just got a <laughs> three pointer. How many can you put in there? Yeah. <laughs> just like she was just getting ready. That actually reminds me of something that happened where I worked when I worked uh, as a waitress for a local place. There was this older woman who got sat at a. It was like a metal chair for one of the side rooms we had. And she sits down with her party, and I was like, "Can I get you any guys like water to start?" And she's like, she looks at me, like all shaking, and like she slowly turns to me and goes, "I'm in extreme pain." That's <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, I'm like, um, like what do you need? Some she's more like, water? <laughs> uh, more water? <laughs> do you need to leave? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I got her a pillow, and uh, we put it behind her back so that. She wasn't in extreme pain anymore. Oh, cool. But she slid me like a dollar <laughs> as I gave <laughs> her the pillow. Yeah, I don't think the bank will take all this. Well. <laughs> yeah, <it won't> <laughs> Imagine if I complained about how much it was. Oh, it's all you got, huh? Yeah. Fork it up. That I pillow walked wasn't over. Cheap. Yeah. I walked all the way to the other side of the hall to get right. that pillow. <laughs> well, I guess this is, uh, you don't get a dollar pillow. <laughs> okay. Or you don't I get take a the pillow. Dollar, but I take the pillow back. Yeah. It's gonna cost you more than that. It's gonna cost you more than that, old <laughs> bag. A dollar a second. <laughs> yeah. It's a rental. Oh, uh, man. Rental. There's probably tons of other waitressing and waiter stories that you and I have, but Jove, I think you did, what, one shift as a server, I think? Yeah, they didn't really train me, and, like, um, like all my co-workers were, like, high schoolers, so I was just like... Oh, the worst. Yeah. I feel like I was just like, you know, this is not the move. So oh, yeah. Like, <laughs> the yeah. work environment can really just be... That's how I felt, because I... I'm oh, sorry. It was at a breakfast place, right? Yeah, it was a breakfast spot. And, um... It's a shitty breakfast spot. Like, I've, tr- I've tried their stuff, and it's just, like, not... It's like you can tell, like, they don't, like, season anything, and just, like... Oh, uh, yeah. I fucking hate that. Right. That's why like, I don't really care for, like, Bob Evans. It's not Bob Evans. <laughs> but, like, <laughs> their french fries are not fucking seasoned at all. Yeah. Just their bland as hell. They have the worst fucking fries. Which... I was about to be really surprised. I was like, you've never bad mouthed Bob Evans. No, well, that's because now I don't get their french fries. If anything, I get, like, fucking hash browns or, like, yeah. home fries. But regular french fries there fucking are terrible. They're just bland as hell. Right. That's why I only get, like, breakfast food. Yeah. But Well, there uh, you go. They fucking go, exactly. They do have great breakfast food. And pie. Oh yeah, I like the I like the chocolate pie they have. That's good. So good. I like them little cinnamon biscuits. They, they had there. those cinnamon biscuits when they were new were like so cheap. They were they were like cheap. two dollars for a bunch of cinnamon biscuits. It was awesome. They're like what, like five fucking bucks now? Probably more. I don't know. I haven't been to supply and demand. <laughs> supply no. my ass, ass. They need to supply my demand. Supply my demand. Yeah. Make it free. <laughs> <laughs> free food for me. Free food for life. That's what I fucking want. Well, the Bob Evans B fell on me. <laughs> I need free biscuits for life. Ah, <laughs> oh, shit. Now I'm trying to wreck my brain helmet about, like, other fucking little misadventures I've been on while at work. Uh, let's see. I'm sure you got one. I've got one, but it might... Just fucking do it. They're never going to find it. Okay. <laughs> uh, this is at my current job. I had oh. uh, my very first trainee... And, um, you know, he was doing fine. He honestly did well. But um, 
He kept having like medical problems, and um, he would just be out. And, uh, oh. Yeah, and I and I'd be like, "Hey, you doing okay?" And he's like, "I had to go to the emergency room." I was like, "Oh my god, like, are are you all right?" Like, he lived by himself, so I was like, "Do you need somebody? Like, what's going on?" He's like, "I just came back from the bathroom after eating Chipotle, and it was all blood." And I was like, "Oh my god, he was fine in the end, but um, if you've ever watched South Park, yeah, I was about to make that joke. <laughs> Chipotle, yeah. Way. Chipotle Way, did yeah, he, use that in his he needed Chipotle Way." <laughs> Yeah, he ended up being just fine, but... <laughs> I was gonna say, that's normal. Like, if it's just, like, blood. <laughs> straight blood. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, God. It's fucking hilarious. I can only share that, because nothing bad happened. <laughs> that's good, yeah. I'm trying to think, what else? Where else have we worked that has, like, a good story that... Hmm. No, I'm trying to recall the places I've worked. I know, and I'm wrecking my fucking mind. I do. Oh, I've got one. I used to work at a wedding venue that was also a winery. Oh. And there was one day where, um, like, we came in and the bar sets up at about the same time that the reception's happening. And me and the other bartenders are, like, watching the reception because we finished early. And we look out and we see everyone is signing to each other. And we're like, um, <laughs> none of us know how to sign. Yeah. And so we all had to, like, improvise the whole night. But You're it was, just screaming the whole time. Yeah, totally. <laughs> How many drinks do you want? <laughs> no, they they were good about it. They would use their phones. They would like they could read our lips pretty well. Like they they made do, but the, there's a chance uh, pants shitting moment of just seeing them only signing to each other. Like all of them. It wasn't a handful. It was everyone. So you just hear the quiet shuffling of hands and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Get right up in there and do it. Make that noise. Lotioned up. You gotta go like. Yeah, like that. <laughs> it's a pretty good one. Uh, this is at my current job, which, fuck it. I'll just go for it. Um, not me, but two co-workers of mine. I heard it through the grapevine. They got fucking fired because they were, like, banging on the clock. And, uh, yeah, I don't work in, like, an office or anything. I, like, travel a lot. We're, we're all, all the, like, my co-workers kind of, we all, like, travel independently. So I don't really see them. Or anything, unless like I talk to them or like ask, "Hey, can you come to my like location?" And yeah, I was just told like one of my coworkers was helping me with something, and he's like, "Oh yeah, this uh, these two guys were like, yeah, the guy fucking like had a like a had like a son and a wife and everything, and it's like, ugh, imagine being fucking fired for that and having to tell like your fucking family like, oh, why you were fired? They definitely did not share the real reason. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, that's wild. No, blew my fucking mind. We're all like, like, like honey, nerdy technicians and shit, so it's like, what the fuck? Whoa. Honey, I gotta work from home. <laughs> <laughs> it just does nothing. Jesus fuck. Has anything recent happened to you, Jove? In the line um, I can think of one funny story. I used to work at um like a land center where like a bunch of people like um would uh like kind of cut like it was like a public like um gaming spot so it was just like everyone was kind of like <laughs> pl like playing Sorry. games together like um there was like a bunch of pcs like everyone could like kind of like play games together it was a really cool place but like um like i worked as like um i was like a cashier i made the food and then like i would also like like um like clean the spot basically just kind of did like odd jobs around the around the place and um i remember i made a sandwich for a kid and like um it was, I was like really proud of the sandwich because it was just like you know like really finely crafted like I got like the fries all right I got like everything like good and then like I handed it to him like he looked at it and he's like is there mayo on this and I was like I think there's like a slight bit of mayo and he's like oh okay and he tossed the entire thing in the trash <laughs> fucking kids immediately man. and like it's just like no because you know it was like their like dad's money or something, something. oh yeah 100% <laughs> yep. It's like whatever. Then starve. And then starve. And then there was like one guy, like he just dropped dropped his kid off at like um just all day. Like he would just leave his kid there all day, like just while he went binge drinking or something. Like, oh my god. So we were basically so we we're basically just like the babysitting. <laughs> like he, he became kind of like a like an honorary crew member, just like this eight year old that just played Fortnite like twelve hours a day. When you worked oh there, didn't they have to implement like some smell? Thing. Yeah, um, <laughs> yeah, I used to, I used to play, um, Smash Bros, like, I did, like, um, like, competitive tournaments sometimes, and, like, we held, like, a tournament, and, um, yeah, it was, like, one of the things, like, uh, like, if you smelled, like, shitty enough, like, you'd be denied at the door, like, if you're just, like, 
grossly neglecting personal hygiene because like <laughs> I feel like the the default gamer smell is just like not great. But like if you if you're like walking around with, like shit in your pants and like. <laughs> Did just you like, have like a sniffer at the door? I was about to say, sniffle. was that I you mean, should have went for that position? Big, just give everyone. <sighs> it's like if you didn't have good. to sniff, like you just smelled it like before they even walked in the front door. Like you could just like feel the feel the odor coming wow. from the wall. Were there some fellows you can kind of taste when you get a smell in there and it's like yeah. just to the back of your throat? <laughs> That's really really gross. Yeah, it's just like <laughs> you know they can't shower, bro. The water levels are too tough. <laughs> Yeah, the water drains their HP and it makes them lose a stock. Yeah. Why is that such a fucking thing? Why do? Why is that like? What's the mentality? Just not showering. Yeah. Not wanting to. I got a game. Because he's gaming out. Ugh. Lord. Makes me think of another South Park episode where they're just like sh sitting on a bucket, <laughs> so they didn't have to go to the bathroom. Oh, bathroom. Yeah. Bathroom. <laughs> yeah. Oh, someone's a big boy. Oh yeah. His <laughs> diarrhea is all over his mom. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Oh, that's right, she brought the bucket, right? Yeah, she right? brings the bucket down and, like, holds it while he, like, gets his ass out and, like, shits all over her in the bucket. That's a, that's a gamer special. I had to do that for like, <laughs> most of the people there. Oh, my fuck. <laughs> we just had, like, the buckets ready. Just on the side. It's like a, just a like, little dishpan. They have the little game, lo a game place, like, logo on there, too. Like, official bucket. Yeah. Official shit and bucket. Official shit and bucket. <laughs> Oh What's my god. the gosh. reward if you win the Smash tournament? The golden bucket? The golden bucket. <laughs> free to use. <laughs> I'll use it right now. We'll give you a free meal in it. <laughs> oh, it's, a, it's an eating and shit bucket. <laughs> right. So put all your snacks Versatile. in. Versatile. <laughs> Multiple uses. <laughs> you don't even have to wash it. <laughs> <laughs> and when the mood's just right, throw up in it. <laughs> <laughs> you know, if it's, a, if it's a special evening, you know, you can up chuck in it. <laughs> Well, before it gets any more cruder, I think we've hit about an hour, so I think that we'll wrap it up for today. Piss, puke, shit. I think that's a good way to call it. Yeah, it's, this was a well-rounded podcast. I mean, hey. Just like that turd that was found <laughs> yeah, in the Yeah, well-rounded. You know? See, it all comes around like that turd found in the toilet all those years ago. <laughs> By the way, you tapped on a podcast called Grubs. This is your own fault. This is fault. your fault. Yeah, it's you were your warned. fault. Your fault. <laughs> you saw it. Well, once again, I'm Dill. I'm Jove. And, and I'm uh, the guest, Tor, and you don't get to talk anymore. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> what were you saying? Because Tor has the floor now. Because I was going to introduce, because they're like, who is this? I guess we never really did, huh? Yeah, I was going to do it, but it's fine. <laughs> Doesn't matter. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> just fix it in post. Yeah, we'll cut that out in post. <laughs> uh, well, Can you edit it so... Uh, when we introduce ourselves, it's all Jove just introducing himself <laughs> as yeah. the guest. It's me, it's me, it's me, it's me. <laughs> <laughs> A panel, Jove, Jove, and Jove. <laughs> I'd watch that. I would too. I wouldn't watch it. <laughs> I'd listen. I'd turn it off, like, immediately. <laughs> I'd listen to it every night. <laughs> it would lull me to sleep. Lull me to sleep. Jove SMR. Oh, ASMR. What, help. What would be a mix of your name and ASMR? Um. Jove cunt. SMR. <laughs> I like cunt. It yeah, gets to cunt. the point. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good day, everybody. We grubbing. hate all of you. Thanks for grubbing. Bye. Whenever oh. you need us, just go outside, grab a handful of dirt, look underneath it or a big rock. You'll find us <laughs> grubbing it up. Grubbing it out. Grubbing out with our grubs out. <laughs> grub up and grub out. <laughs>